Hi guys, Pastor Tom here. Want to uh, read one verse of scripture to you today uh, of a word of David from Psalm number five, verse 12. He said, surely Lord, you bless the righteous. You surround them with your favor as with a shield. You know, for me, the thought of having God's favor in my life is imperative. I'm sure you feel the same way. Someone said, a moment of favor is worth more in the long run than a lifetime of labor. That certainly is not to, meant to minimize all of our hard work, but it's intended to emphasize the importance of having God's favor active in our lives. This favor is the free, unmerited grace of God. You cannot earn it. You must receive it as God's free gift to you. Favor in the Old Testament is grace in the New Testament. This grace is what causes our salvation. We are saved by grace through faith. We cannot earn our salvation. That's important to know, to remember, and to live by. Yes, I said to live by. We live by grace also. We live by this unmerited favor in our lives. Dear brothers and sisters, God blesses those who have received righteousness from him. He, and he surrounds them with his favor. This favor is our security blanket for life. Yes, it's our safety and security. That means God's favor is the thing that covers your life, protects you, and keeps you, and shields you. That's good news. In times when uh, our world is going crazy, when people are worried about a, a worldwide plague, God's favor is our security. When many financial systems are on the brink of collapse, God's favor is our security. When evil forces want to snuff out righteousness throughout our land and throughout our country, God's favor is our security. L let us be those people that believe. Uh, for God's favor in our personal life, our family, our community, and for our country. Ask God to clothe you with the righteousness of Jesus and to release his favor into each of these areas of your life and in the world around you. Believe that God's favor will act as a spiritual shield of protection and security for you. Surely, Lord, you bless the righteous. You surround them with your favor as with a shield. Friend, God surely blesses those who put their trust in him. I believe he's going to bless you today as you look to him. Seek his righteousness first and expect his favor to bring blessing into every area of your life. Expect his favor to cover you as a security blanket. Believe it in Jesus' name. Amen.